Good to see you again. My name is Jill from the professional services team at firewalls.com, here to introduce you to SonicWall's application control security service. App Control operates at the application layer and primarily provides application level access control, application level layer bandwidth management, and data leakage prevention. With App Control, a network administrator can block entire applications based on their signatures, block application features or subcomponents, and uh, bandwidth throttling for file types when using HTTP or FTP protocols, and even send a custom block page. And like CFS, Content Filtering Service, App Control requires a purchase of a license from SonicWall and access to the application signature database. This is critical because the database gets updated with signatures as new attacks emerge. Today we'll be navigating the App Control configuration space and making a simple block for all users behind the firewall. In this example, we'll be using the very popular live streaming service, Twitch. We love Twitch, no offense to Twitch, but not on our precious company bandwidth. All right, so let's get started. Like always, this is a TC370 wireless for our lab box. Um, first, we're going to verify we, hire, we are licensed for um, app control. And you can see here on the home dashboard, you can also head to device on the top, left side settings, and then licenses. Here you'll find that app control is part of the essential protection service suite. You can also verify at gateway services app control is licensed. Um, now we're going to head over to policy on the top, left side security services, and then you'll find app control just below that. Here's where you can verify that the da database is downloading to your device, to your firewall. Um, so you can see here it was last downloaded yesterday, um, but it was checked this morning. First thing you're going to do is you're going to enable app control, um, enable logging and file name logging. Hit accept. Now today we're going to do a simple configuration, but if you wanted to exclude, this is where you would set that up. All right, so for this example, like I said, we are going to block Twitch. Now, the application GUI is pretty simple to understand. You have this bar at the top where you can sort the signatures. Um, you can view them bundled up by application. And SonicWall does a category Uh, organization as well. So you could block all the applications and all the signatures associated with multimedia or point to point, um, proxy access, gaming, and so on. So we are going to find application and we're going to find Twitch here. There is a search bar, so we're going to go ahead and take advantage of that. And here it is Twitch. Um, right now it is not blocked. You can see here it is logging but not blocked. I'm going to verify that we can reach Twitch by going to the site. Okay, good. I also have the application on my computer so let's open that up. There's a Twitch application. It's loading. And there it is. Put it in the middle. Okay, so let's go back to the firewall. And we are going to hit the editing pencil right here. And you'll find the block. And you're going to hit enable. And the rest we're going to leave um, under category the base settings we had already uh, configured on the first page. Hit OK. And it's that simple. Um, let's see. Okay, so now we're going to open an incognito window just in case the, um, the other one cached. So Twitch. And 
and it's not loading so now let's try to open the application click on the icon and there you go perfect I'm going to minimize this and head over to the firewall again let's disable it hit ok and now let's try again there you go um, now I block the whole application if you click on signature you can see individual um, signatures for the app um, you can also check out severe risk let's delete twitch here severe risk uh, and then you know any category or application and start blocking that way Um, application control is going to be applied to persona. So if you head over to object on the top, on the left side, you'll find match objects and then click on zones. So as you can see here, I have app control at this time. I have it enabled for the LAN and the WAN. Um, I could go and turn it on for the DMC. Um, and any other zone that I might create in the future. If you haven't already, check us out at firewalls.com where you can find a large selection of top rated security devices and learn more about our managed firewall service. Thank you for watching and we'll see you at the next one.